doesn't matter really what way you put it into your mouth. Normally you put the whistle in, well, this is, I set it against my tongue and... The tongue normally falls at the back of your whistle or just stays against it. You just your lips fall over it here and... When you're training a young dog, you'll always teach him on voice commands first. You're away here, come by and stand or lie down and you'll walk on. Basically when your dog knows these quite well, you'll gradually bring him onto the whistles. Whichever whistle sounds that you prefer to use, you'd start him roughly from in around a year, year and a half, depending on the dog and how good he is to learn, but you'll just basically tell him to away and when the dog is on the away command you'll <coughs> away, away here <coughs> and you'll just put the dog round like that, then you will change him and you'll take him to the left, tell him come by, when you have the dog circling on the left you'll give him <coughs> come by, <coughs> just work him basically like that, you'll stop, you'll tell him to stand or lie down and as you're doing that you'll <coughs> lie down. <coughs> 